when you're a physical specimen, that yes. tends to happen. You know. Hey everyone, Uncle B here, coming to you from colorful Colorado. Uh, we got an estate sale to go to this morning. I'm here with my friend Frank again. We're going to go check out some estate sales. Or one estate sale and there's a church sale we're going to go check out. Um, so let's go to the first sale, see what we can find. All right, let's go. Hey buddy. Hi. How's it going? Alright, how are you doing? I'm doing alright. Looks like you got your hands full already. That's good. Yes sir. Look at this. Mario and Luigi. Alright, so we just got done with that first sale. Not a whole lot of hard goods or electronics that I'm interested in, but I did find a couple of Boy Scout and Cub Scout shirts, and I also found a um, Super Mario and Luigi Halloween costume. I gotta get those listed right away because that ha Halloween's coming right around the corner. Hopefully, I can get those sold. I might even put them on the local marketplace just to see, um, to get, get them in the customers' hands faster. But yeah, uh, not a lot. I think I spent eight dollars and I got eight items, so it was a dollar piece. Uh, Frank, what'd you find? I uh, didn't find anything. They were only taking cash only, and all I had was card on me, unfortunately, at this point. So, had to, uh, most of the state sales will take card. Unfortunately, this one didn't, so I put a couple things back. There wasn't anything really great. Jimmy, yeah. got, Jimmy got the good stuff before uh, I could get to it. There was, there was a lot of clothes, um, but at this point, I've got a death pile of clothes I'm dealing with so there wasn't anything spectacular that would have been worth uh, buying so it was a pretty uh, it was an interesting sell to say the least it was a lot of a lot of stuff but nothing that really uh, got us real excited yeah, so not a lot of electronics or hard goods that I would buy and again I, I'm, I imagine there were some hard goods that other people might be interested in I'm really not into glassware and stuff like that yet I don't have enough knowledge on it and I really just don't feel like taking the time to learn about that when I have a lot of other categories that I I know enough about to get by so we're heading to a church sale now let's go see what we can find at that church sale hang out with us
I don't know, there's a bunch of those. Uh, there's a bunch of vintage uh, s special Olympic stuff in there. Song. They good? Yeah, how much? Christmas stuff? 
this. How much is it selling for? There's one listed for three ninety nine. Three dollars and ninety nine cents. Lays up. So we just left that church sale. I've been to this church sale before. They seem to have it every couple weeks. On some uh, still sealed uh, cassette tapes, that um, blank cassette tapes that I'm going to send into Amazon. Looks like the block of 12, I'll get $50 for that block of 12, and I paid $4 for it. And then the other blank ones that are individual, I'll have to, when I get home, price those out. And I know Frank scored, um, he did pretty good on that Christmas decoration that I passed on. I didn't look it up, so... So yeah, I looked it up right now. Obviously, since we're right in the middle of summer, the 90-day uh, sales on it, there aren't any because of the season. But uh, I did find two listings for that set for $399. And they are, I bought for $5. So, um, well, we'll cross our fingers on that. Other than that, I did get a... Vintage Dukes of Hazards uh, kids drinking cup and uh, a couple vintage Colorado Avalanche starter uh, pullovers. Yeah, starter does go. Um, also got a nice Columbia reversible jacket. I think I paid uh, three bucks a piece for those. So uh, all in all, that was a good score. Um, so I, I love the the community church sales because a couple things. One, it's money going right back into that church. Um, and that's what helps to keep them uh, going. And then obviously the two number two, the the ladies that work there are just adorable. They're awesome. They're friendly. Two different people asked us if me and Jimmy were twins today <laughs> from the same sale. Come on. Uh, I mean, it's not like we look alike or have the same you know physical you know physiques. You know, I can use I mean, the word physique. Uh, when you're a physical specimen, that yes. tends to happen. You know, <laughs> when you're uh, <laughs> yeah. But anyways, it was a good sell, so it was fun, a lot of fun. Check out Community Church Sales, they're, they're definitely, you get the best bargains at those, to be honest with you, because they they just want to make a couple bucks off of their stuff. They're not trying to, they're not sitting there going on eBay and and whatever and trying to price, know, match, price match everything. Yeah. They just want to get a couple bucks out of everything they sell, and um, yeah, so they're worth it. Check them out. All right, so that's it for today, guys. It's a Wednesday, so there's not a lot out there, but we did have a couple sales we wanted to get footage of. Um, hope you liked the video. Please like and subscribe down below. Any comments or questions, uh, in the, just leave those in the comment section. Uh, I will definitely answer or respond to them because I don't get a lot of them yet. Um, but thanks for watching, and keep hustling. Find that treasure.